Hey my pretties, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I am going to share with you some of my favorites. Now, I know that I've said it before in my other favorites video, but I don't do these too often for the simple fact that I have to actually use a product for a while before I can share it with you guys to actually say that I love this product. So I do have a few things in front of me that I wanna share with you. Before I get started, if you're new to my channel, hi, welcome. Make sure you hit that subscribe button to stick around. I'd love for you to do that. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna jump right into it because uh, there's not a whole lot of items, but they're the items that I love right now. So my two go-to um, lip glosses at this moment because uh, most of the time all I do is throw on a lip liner. My favorite lip liners are from MAC, but that's not what we're talking about today. Um, but I usually just throw on a lip liner and a really nice gloss. And my favorite is the TARDIS Lip Paint in the color Cinnamon. And then I also am loving this High Shine Gloss, the Villains Collection, um, and this is Maleficent that you can get from Ulta. So both of them are kind of similar. This one just has more of a rose gold tint to it. This one has more of a, like a pink pearl, but really, really light pink pearl, but they're really nice. And I just love uh, putting them on with my lip liner because they're not really thick, but they have um, really nice color when you put them on. And this one has that real high shine to it. And they're both reasonably priced. This one I actually got in I think my camera is acting crazy. I don't know, I keep seeing it get blurry, so if it's doing that, I apologize. I have to work with my settings. I don't know what's going on with it today. Um, but this one came in a set of three, and I believe, I can't remember, I did do a video when I went into Ulta, um, but yeah, that's where this one came from, but the color is cinnamon. Okay, now I recently showed you guys these and I'm telling you when I was when I showed these to you guys, I was dead serious when I said I love these shoes. I love shoes, period. That is like one of my favorite things to purchase. So you guys probably did see these, the converse that um the young lady uh on Instagram hit me up and she said, you know, I bling out stuff. Can I send you a pair of Chucks? Um, you know, so I paid for these, but she sent them and I showed them to you before, but I am in love with these. I've only worn them once. I'm super scared because they're so pretty, <laughs> but I'm really light on my shoes, so I'm not really worried about it. But I did wear these one time and look at these in case you missed that video. Really pretty. Hold on. There it is. Let's focus on that. So like I said before, if you guys are looking for some custom shoes or anything, you know, I will link her down below again um, so that you guys can check her out. And she puts the cute little uh, satin like laces in there. Super cute. I am in love with these shoes and I do need to order another pair. I don't know. We're probably going to do a different color or maybe not pearls, maybe the gems. I'm not too sure, but um I love these shoes and if you are interested then I will link her down below. Next item from Bath & Body Works is the aromatherapy line. I love all of their fragrances from the aromatherapy line. The lotions, the body wash, the candles, all of that. But right now what is actually working really good, not only for me, but for Pooh Bear, let me tell you, <laughs> that boy can be so wild sometimes. So what I found is that after he has a bath, if I rub some of this on him, like especially on his arms in this area, and I do it on myself as well, it's the sleep with the lavender and the cedarwood. It smells so good. This is so calming and relaxing. You will definitely fall asleep with this, and I love it. Just, oh, just the fragrance. Oh my gosh, it's so good. So if you're looking for something to just kind of relax you, put you in that mood to go to sleep at night, definitely check out the sleep from Aromatherapy with the Bath and Body Works line. I keep hesitating because my camera keeps getting blurry on me and I wanna think that it's because of the lighting behind me, I'm not too sure, but hopefully it's not real, real bad. So if you see me looking up, it's cause I'm looking at the monitor to see if it's getting blurry cause I'm like, you better stop it. <laughs> <laughs> now the next thing is the strawberry lip mask with collagen and they came in a package like this and I absolutely love these oh my gosh I've showed you guys these before and they're just some strawberry little lip uh, masks like that and you just put them on your lips 
leave them there for a while five minutes and then you just take it off and it helps your lips to feel hydrated moisturized really really nice i do use a lip exfoliant um if i'm not using this so i do do a, a lip scrub which i have a lip scrub that i love from lush um and then if i'm not using that then i'll definitely use my lip mask but yeah so that's a must have now any items that i'm mentioning mentioning sorry any items that i'm mentioning i will put down below in the description box just in case you are interested now the next items i have been using for a while and i had to keep using them i switched out i used some other shampoos um and i have to tell you i am in love now most of you have heard of carol's daughter um her hair products but she has a lot of stuff out there this one is my favorite it's the carol's daughter almond milk restoring conditioner and the sulfate free shampoo the shampoo works really good um it definitely cleanses your hair really good and then once you put the restoring conditioner back on there because you stripped out all your oils and everything with the shampoo this <sighs> conditioner is life like oh my gosh i don't even know what to say it's so good it has really good slip to it um it just it, it just if you have dry hair you definitely want to try this definitely and then the other item from her that i've been using is the almond milk leave-in conditioner which works really really good i use this on not only on my head but on my daughter's hair and on Pooh bear's hair so this item definitely goes faster than these two but i love carol's daughter almond milk products okay so since we're talking about lush and i did mention that i use one of their lip scrubs which is actually behind me probably right at the tip of my finger right there it's the blueberry lip scrub and i keep it because i use it in the shower after i wash my face I might exfoliate my lips and then I rinse it off in the shower. Now, my favorite product from them, oh my gosh, is the Yognog Fragrance Everything. Anything that's Yognog. Now, let me tell you why. I love perfumes that have that car caramel, I was going to say caramel, that caramel, um, sensual, um, chocolatey type of a fragrance like i'm not into florals at all um and so this right here it even says cozy up to a creamy caramel scented uh lather with a touch of spicy clove so that fragrance to me is so yummy it's so good so it's i haven't really had to use this one because i was still getting through this bottle that i have which is at the bottom I'm almost done with that so once i'm done with that i will jump into this one but i am so in love with that fragrance and then they also gave me this when you guys see my other video with me when i partnered with lush um this is the yognog body conditioner so when i'm in the shower when i'm about to get out after i've washed myself with the body wash you put this on if you don't like putting lotion on after you get out of the shower you definitely want to get this so when i'm in the shower i basically just take some on my hand and you just rub your whole body down be very careful because items like this can make you slip in the shower uh once it runs down so you have to be very careful with that but it's just like putting like a body moisturizer on the water runs down it kind of melts onto your skin and so you pretty much don't have to put a lotion on after you get out of the shower, which is perfect for me because I just hate doing that task. It's like a job. <laughs> so to do it in the shower, I just, I love this and it smells amazing. This one says fair trade cocoa butter meets maple syrup. So as you can probably tell, the fragrances are sweet and maple syrup and caramels and all of that. So also what i just learned was that they have their own fragrances now so lush has created some perfumes and some body sprays and you guys last night i went on there and i purchased the body spray the yognog body spray and it's coming in the mail and i cannot wait because 
I just love that fragrance. Like even after I take a shower and I'm laying down, if I'm not using this right here, the one I just showed you, the, the sleep for relaxing, that y'all nog is just so relaxing to me. It smells so good. And I cannot, I, I cannot speak any more highly of this. Like I just love it. I love this fragrance. Um, yeah, I'll probably have to, once I get the, the body spray, if I, if I think it smells what I think it smells like, I will probably purchase probably two more bottles because I think these are seasonal and I know I'm going to want them through the year until they come back. <laughs> okay, so enough of that. Um, next, my exfoliating slices, my lemon slices uh, by Clean and Clear. And they're just some little exfoliating uh, pads that you use on your face and they're shaped like a little lemon. And at the end of the night when I'm getting myself prepped to go to bed, I'm use that to wipe it on um you know do my whole face and it swipes away pore clogging dirt and oil and it does have a very lemony fragrance it smells really really good but if you can feel it opening up your pores and just getting all the dirt off of you so this is my go-to as far as wiping my face off getting you know everything all the dirt off and everything uh for the evening okay so The next item is my Fresh Balsam from Bath & Body Works. I burn these all through my house. This one is pretty much done unless I cut this out. What I usually do when they get to the bottom like that, I would usually um, warm it up a little bit, put, it in, put the glass in some hot water and I'll loosen it up and then I'll cut those and I'll just put this part, I mean put the, the cubes that I cut out of here into my wax warmer just to be able to use the rest of this. Um, so that's what I plan on doing. But fresh balsam around Christmas is my all-time favorite because if you're if you're using artificial trees in your house, you want to still have that Christmas fragrance uh, going throughout your house. Then this one definitely. So I've stocked up on these. I have a few between me and my son. Oh my gosh, we burn these like crazy. Another pine scent that I have that I like to use is the Miss Myers Clean Day Multi Surface in Iowa pine scent between this one and the peppermint one which I do use as well I really like both of those um I forgot to bring the peppermint one up here but I have peppermint and then I love to use this pine one so uh yeah these are definitely staples in my house uh during the holidays okay so the last three items are by the same brand now let me tell you if I'm not using yog nog in the shower right here this is it this is the one raw sugar i love the raw sugar brand that you get from um target i don't know if they sell them wherever else they sell it at probably everywhere i don't know but i always get my raw sugar products from target this one moisture loving body wash let me tell you watermelon and fresh mint do you know what a watermelon now later smells like or a watermelon Jolly Rancher. Like just imagine the sweetest watermelon candy you can think of right here. This is exactly what that smells like. My daughter loves this body wash. This sets up really nicely. It, um, I just put it on a loofah. It gets really, really soapy. It doesn't leave any thick film or, or like residue on your skin or anything. And it just washes away really nice, but it smells so so good um but if you don't really like really sweet fragrances then i would tell you not to get this but if you like that this watermelon and fresh mint is definitely something i urge you to pick up my other two raw sugar products is an exfoliant right here and this one is the lemon sugar uh exfoliant nourish and renew and i've always spoke about how when i use an exfoliant i like my uh sugar crystals to be kind of um coarse not really coarse to where like it's cutting my skin, but I don't like the really small granules of um, sugar or whatever they put in there, Epsom salt, sugar, whatever it is. Um, I don't like them to be really small to where when you rub it on your skin, you don't really feel the granules. I like to know that it's actually doing its job. And then when you get the lemon sugar with it, it just feels so good. 
and with the fragrance of the lemon it this is just a really nice product so i've been using this for a while i love their packaging um i believe they are from california which is local oh my camera my camera i'm almost ready to give up i'm happy this is the last item because it keeps getting blurry on me it's it's acting really crazy today um so what i was saying was the last item is the raw sugar fresh and light cold press ultra hydrating anytime everywhere lotion look at that look at that there see <laughs> this is the lotion it is the lemon sugar just like the um the scrub right here and yeah so this works just as good and um yeah so if i'm not again if i'm not using the yognog when i get out the shower i will sit down and put this on uh for moisture so that is it you guys i'm gonna wrap this up because it's driving me crazy that my camera keeps getting blurry on me you guys just don't know how much like i had to try to work around it and yeah so let me wrap this up before it get blurry on me right now i hope you guys enjoyed my favorites um i will link these items down below so thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this and i'll talk to you real soon in my next video bye